Hey, this is Joyce Chow for MBN and News Video Web. We're here at the Roger Neal Style Hollywood Lounge, and we're here with one of, well, a huge sponsor, Shakar. I'm going to get it, Rahate. Yes, you're right. Yes. You got that. Who does all these absolutely gorgeous red carpet gowns. Now, one, I know I've been coming over here. You've been swamped with women trying on all these gowns. And we are now into, what do you call it, countdown days to Oscars. Yeah, it's like three days left now. Yeah, three days left. And I noticed, because these have been so popular, you know, it always goes to what? The presenters, the nominees, right? All, yeah. all the big people first. But I noticed you've got all these numbers on these gowns. Yeah. See, some of them, uh, these numbers, just basically we have numbered them. So we know and we are tra keeping a track of okay. the gowns, like what number is going for what. And we have like few numbers like size number 0 to 20 is size 0 to 2 ah. and 21 to 30 is 0, 2 to 4, 4 to 6, 6 to 8 because here I, last year I was in the same speed, I was, it was a very big success for me and one of my, the actress, Marian Brooke wore my gown, uh, she's from the God of Love film and they got Academy Award for the, That's yeah, big for the big deal and uh, for the uh, best short film mm -hmm. and she was wearing my gown while receiving the Oscars. So after that, uh, this is my second year in the same Roger Neal's Oscar suite and, uh, and last year I realized like uh, there are uh, more than two and four sizes they expect <laughs> to be here because they are actresses. Uh, because I'm in a high fashion, so generally my models are by a size zero and two. But uh, <laughs> but then I now this year I have from zero to twelve. I have size zero, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So I have all the sizes, and I'm actually realized that all my sizes are going. Last year, though I had like small sizes, I was able to get only ten gowns on the Oscars. But this year, though I have big sizes. Till now, I have given 21 gowns on for the Oscars red carpet. Wait a minute, and did you say 21 gowns you're yeah. expecting? Yeah, like they are gone oh. already for the Oscars event, but right now, I'm styling few more people. So maybe until the end, today's, like the day ends, I'm going to style three, four more people. There are more actresses on the way. She just called me and she says, I need a gown. She was not happy with some other designer and all. So she's rushing to me. So let's see how does it goes. Well, you know what? That's absolutely phenomenal because one of the things at the suite is there's over 200 um, celebrities and VIPs yes. that are coming to the suite. So. Yes, very good people show up. Like I was, uh, we have more nominees this year. Like I have almost four to five nominees came to the suite and other people from many uh, like talk shows and soaps and films. Uh, it was a very good crowd. Like the four days were very productive days basically. So if you were to classify your gowns, or if you were describing them yourself, how would you describe your style? They, I don't want to exaggerate myself, but uh, <laughs> I like to say my red carpet gowns. Your red carpet, okay. Yeah. I keep uh, uh, in mind, like when I design a gown or uh, when I do my cuttings, I always visualize how this gown will look on the red carpet. Accordingly that, I do the, my designing and my cuttings. So one of the things I'm always curious about, and we'll see how much you can tell us, because you can't always tell us who's going to be wearing what, but you can tell us what gowns we might expect to be seen on the red carpet this Oscar Sunday. See, uh, you you can expect, uh, see, Oscar, see, I have observed almost last more than 20 years, like how Oscar's uh, red carpet is being styled by different, different designers all, right. all over the world, and there will never be... Uh, a, a, like a similarity on the gowns I've seen amazing creativity something different always in always so I'm telling I'll describe Oscar's red carpet is as the biggest fashion show in the world oh, that's, I will that's describe a good way it like it. yeah that's how I'll put you get the best designers best styles best curves best embroideries uh, best crystal work best bead work on those and everything is different I'm looking forward to see some of the actresses like the artists Mm -hmm. Actress, she's, uh, she's uh, size zero, two, and she has very great personality. I'll, I'm expecting like what she's wearing. Like I really oh, want to see what yeah. she's wearing. So, yeah. what are some of your favorites that are that are still left here? <laughs> <laughs> no, many of their favorites. There are nobody has picked up. This is one of my favorite gown. This uh, and then uh, this is one of my favorite gown. This uh, it just came from the tailor yesterday. It were in the production. I got nine gowns yesterday from the tailor. They were in the production. Uh, I just made this for the Oscar. This is like my Oscars collection. This is being created for this year Oscars. 
So, anyways, I'm still expecting few more people. Even some people wants to come to my studio tomorrow. They want to come on Saturday. So I will be still styling until the day of the show. So let's see how does it goes. My studio is just two blocks away from here, so everybody is happy to come there. So. You, you make it easy. I know yeah. you're te you're teasing us, but we're also doing this, so we want to see what the material looks like and the texture. Shakar, Thank a you. couple more. Sure. <laughs> Yeah, see, uh, actually this is one of the gowns I really want to be on the red carpet, if possible, if I get the girl on this size. So this is the gold, it's a, it's a complete beadwork, you can see, and this is actually the back, and you can see the work on the back. There's a lot of work, there's a lot of efforts, whenever you do beadwork or crystal work, it takes a lot of time, a lot of patience, like many times we design sometimes we don't like so we scrap it we make it again so there is there's a lot of efforts to make whenever you do embroidery or a bead work there's a lot of efforts put into that that makes perfect sense uh, i know i know it's yes, getting crazy is, over here this is one of my favorite gowns this is the style i like to develop the actual dress is on a short dress See, this is actually the dress uh, where but this is little it's kind of prevailing the legs comes out from here and this is only actually the back train so you actually have wear this one like this oh, that and that great. will go on the back so this is kind of one of my favorite styles oh that is beautiful well shikar these are gorgeous expect to see a lot of them on the red carpet this sunday thank you hope and so <laughs> you hope so and if people want to find out more about you on the internet where's the best place to go best thing is google my name shikar rahate or my website shekharate.com or you just like put, search my name anywhere it's pretty i'm pretty uh, lucky and uh, opportunities like you can call me i'm doing like my name is coming out now like people are supporting me they are liking my work a lot of celebrities liking my work uh, some people like they are not waiting for oscars but they want to work with me in the future so even i'm expecting the emmys are coming then uh, we have Cannes Film Festival, that's like one more big show. Like last year I had 27 gowns on Cannes Film Festival. Wow. So this year I'm expecting at least them or that's more. Really, that's really exciting. So let's see how does it goes. Well, we'll be watching you. Okay, great. To Karahate, <laughs> Thank you. see him on the red carpet. Thank you very much. Thank you.